Hi, I'm Orlando Jones, and I'm joining lots of other people in bringing uh, attention to this very serious disease by accepting this challenge. I think the intention behind the, um, the ice challenge, the ice bucket challenge, as it's sometimes called, is great. And I am gladly going to send my $100 check to support ALS. However, oh man, this, this past week I've watched an American city become something akin to a war zone. And, you know, what's happening in Ferguson looks like a copycat because we've seen it happen in so many other cities around the world and around the globe, which I think are the same thing. It's this sort of us versus them mentality. Now, Thich Nhat Hanh and Sister Chang Kong are still alive, but Gandhi and Martin Luther King and millions of others are, are dead, uh, and they were fighting for human rights. And it all seems to stem from some militarized police force threatening the, threatening the rights of people to assemble. Now, I'm a lifetime member of the NRA, and um, I'm an active member of the great state of Louisiana's police force, obviously a special member. So I'm not pointing any fingers here at anybody but myself. And I'm asking something very hard of myself. I'm challenging myself to listen without prejudice, to love without limits, and to reverse the hate. So that's my challenge to me, and hopefully you'll accept this challenge too.